PJs now. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. I'm so excited because we are currently on the Gold Coast away from my hens weekend. Obviously, you would know that if you clicked on this video. I did a whole separate preparation vlog, so if you wanna see a tour of this place, or the grocery shopping, or the basically the preparation and planning that went into this, please go watch my last vlog because I explained it all there, I showed it all there. This is gonna be the actual vlog of what we get up to, where we go, where we eat, what we do, and I'm really looking forward to it, so welcome. I just set up the gifts for the girls. Beck is on her way because she was already at the coast for a family vacation, so she's just meeting us here. George is out the front, and I am just about to head out there now to wait for Beck. But yeah, if you wanna see a tour for this place, the main tour is in the last one. I feel like such a sweaty, smelly mess because I feel like we haven't stopped all day, which is kind of the opposite of what this holiday is supposed to be. But hopefully the chilling starts now, so. Someone's testing out the top bunk. I'm trying to charge my phone. Fair enough. Fair well, enough. Last, but fair enough. All right, we picked up Beck. Time for surprise! Ooh, what's so cute! What a oh surprise! My goodness. Oh. <laughs> oh, my yes. goodness. I'm a B, you're a G. These are cute. Where did you get these from? They're just from Typo. Yep, got ready for dinner. A little bit later now we had some showers we got ready for dinner we're heading out to the collective at palm beach which i love because it's just so many options you can literally get pretty much anything that you might be craving i am wearing actually can i get you to show my outfit george this is my outfit dress is from princess polly and my shoes are puma nice absolutely stunning so yeah i'm Already ready for food, even though we've been snacking all afternoon. <laughs> Here's Giorgio's outfit. Dress from Dish. Yes. So cute. And then some little sneaky sneaks. Sneak sneaks. Converse. And I think Beck is almost. Are you ready? Cute. <laughs> I love it. Give us your OOTD. Not sure where this is from. Maybe Valley Girl ages ago. Yeah. Belt Princess Polly, pants Princess Polly, and shoes. Cute. I love the platform. The big chunky ones. Wow. Incredible. Very cute. PJs now. I have white ones and the girls have pink. So I'm white with pink, they're pink with white. So cute. But we're trying to get a matching photo. I'll show you our setup. We have the stool. The stool is very cute. The drink bottle. The phone. The self timer little situation on the watch, which is a really great option. Shout out to George for introducing that. But it's just quite a funny situation, to be honest. And cheese. Look at my breath. Yeah. I did yeah. have my eyes closed in all of them. I did, I did. I was like, I should change your head. Oh. Thanks for having me. I think I should be first. Look, it's the mother and her children. Thank you, Jim. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to the next one. I'm going to take you to
Look at this weather. Rainy and sad. Definitely not what I was hoping for. It's been raining all night, so not looking good for any potential beach trips. It's a full-on river going on over there. No, it's not that. I'm so confused. I'm so, I hate that everything beeps. Why is Why it all beeping? beeping? All right, well, <clears throat> I was gonna, ah! I'm gonna throw hands. Why did it just stop? Like, where's the off button? <laughs> this is us trying to figure out if it's the, the dishwasher that's beeping. Something is beeping and we can't figure out what it is. We don't know if it's that, the fridge, the dishwasher, the stovetop, the oven. <laughs> Maybe it's the freaking microwave. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. But I was trying to say, we're making pancakes for breakfast. It was over there. It was over there. It's somewhere over here. I wonder if when we're done with the pancakes, it'll, it'll stop. Yeah. The, I don't know why. the oven? Sure the oven? Well, like, why would that be? It only has started beeping since I've turned it on. Yeah. That's but that has to be on. Yeah, yeah. So I'm like, what if we. Okay, we'll get rid of this. Um, it, as long as we know that we can turn it off. What a weird noise. It sounds like the car reversing. It, it does, that's what I thought it was. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We have just gotten ready for the day and we are now heading off to Holy Moly. I've never been to Holy Moly, which is putt putt for those of you who don't know. They have a bunch of locations. So we're going to the one at Surfers and then probably just like walking around the shops and hanging out for a bit. But our options are a little bit more limited, but we're still just trying to make the most of it. It's supposed to be a little bit more sunny this afternoon, so we're going to save any potential beach trips or beach walks or anything that might be outside for this afternoon, but we'll just have to wait and see how sunny it really gets because it's just not looking incredible. Pop up will be fun, I think. Yes. I think I will suck, but yeah. <laughs> yes. I will be very competitive. Give it my all. I will give it my all. We'll probably have something a bit more substantial later. Yeah, I think we're gonna walk around the shops a little bit after this. It was supposed to be less rainy this afternoon, but it's still raining. We said at one. Let's do it. Okay.
We finally have some blue skies. I mean, the bluest we've seen so far. This is crazy. I mean, the water still looks very gray, but. Oh my goodness. I'm just gonna head down the street to get some food. I think we're feeling sushi, depending on, yeah, depending on what is available. And then we'll probably just come back here and chill again. It's just food, chilling, food, chill, food, chill. <laughs> I don't think I mentioned to you guys, but we're actually heading out to the Belly Pavilion tonight just for a drink. We're probably not going to eat there because we're pretty full from eating our sushi before, but we just thought it would be a fun little gals night out. So we can literally walk there. It was about 50 meters <laughs> from our Airbnb on Belly Hill, which is quite ideal. But we'll see if there's a long wait to get in because sometimes there can be apparently. Day three. We're only here for the morning and then we're heading off, but we're just making ourselves some breakfast. 
and kind of like finishing off whatever we have. We have like a bowl of chocolate sitting there this morning, but making pancakes again. They were actually really good yesterday and we were just using that little like greens, the shaking bottle thing just out of ease. And of course, because Beck has an egg allergy, that makes it really easy for her as well. But it tastes really good. Like I'm so surprised. I don't remember them ever tasting that good when I was a kid, but yeah. And then probably just packing up, cleaning up, and then I don't really know. We've only got a couple hours before checkout, so we'll just see. It's definitely a lot better weather today in saying that. It's still very like misty and cloudy and stuff. Um, it's not really blue skies, but I'm so sad that we're leaving today and it's finally just not raining. The other girls are staying for another few days so they'll be able to enjoy enjoy the sun, but unfortunately, I gotta go home, which is so sad. Just made it home to, I guess my house. I was about to say my parents' house, but I guess it's my place now too. I got some coffee on the way home, which was good. But I'm gonna go in and unpack and unload. I'm honestly really sad to be home purely because I just feel like it wasn't long enough. Like I feel like the past couple days went so fast and I'm so sad. Obviously the weather wasn't very helpful. Literally leaving the beach today while it was sunny was so devastating. But I have so much to be doing here. But I promised myself that I need to make sure I do some beach trips in the next couple weeks or while I'm on holidays because it's just so sad that I went to the beach I didn't even get to go swimming or didn't even get to walk on the sand because so many of the beaches were closed and they were so dangerous and it was so rainy and all of that sort of stuff but I still had a really great time we made the most of the situation we had so much fun yeah I just really I really wish I could have experienced the beach a bit more because it's just my favorite place but let's go inside and say hi to the dogs I don't know if my parents are home at the moment my dad works from home sometimes he does a lot of traveling for his job but when he's not traveling and out with clients and stuff he's at home so he might be but we'll see Hey! Hi! 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 Hello! Okay, should we go say hi to Milo? Milo! Hi! Hey, sweet boy! For those of you who don't know, Milo has a lot of health concerns, so he can't head up the stairs to come meet me as quickly as Bailey does. So we always come and say, <laughs> Bailey, see it. So we always come and say hi to my mic so he doesn't feel left out and he doesn't miss out on all the cuddles. I started unpacking, but I kind of gave up for a second. I unpacked all the food. Priorities, right? I usually only listen to podcasts when I'm in the car and I did actually listen to two on the way home. Maybe I should give you guys my podcast recommendations because I feel like it's always changing, but, but I thought while I was unpacking, I would put on a podcast instead of watching a YouTube video because I can't really watch what's going on. So I've been dying to listen to this and I finally remembered to but i'm listening to ella's new podcast if you don't know my friend ella victoria has a podcast called inspired mind podcast and i've listened to a few of them but i was really excited to listen to this one because she did a podcast while she was in noosa with jesse sophie and riley and if you guys watch georgia which i'm sure you do or honestly any of the girls that i just mentioned you saw that they all went to byron together and then obviously went to noosa and they dropped in to George's place slash my place because I was still living there at the time while they were on their way through and honestly it was so nice to meet them. I love meeting people in this industry who are just so genuinely kind and caring and positive but real and when I met them they were all exactly the same as they are in their videos and I only really got to have a couple little conversations. I didn't get to spend a super long time with them but I was already able to pick that up and I also really trust George's opinions of people and she loved them all but this part podcast is so good and I would really 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 recommend it. I think it's just called girly chat or something like that. Girly chat, toxic positivity, long lasting relationships and more and I haven't finished it yet but it's just so good so I'd really recommend it. I'll try and link it down below if that's a thing. I don't really know how Spotify works with that but I don't know. I just really enjoy all of those girls content and again it's just really awesome to find people in the industry who are just so genuinely lovely. So I think I'm going to chill for a sec, keep listening to this podcast and then also keep unpacking so that's over and done with because I have a bunch of stuff I need to do today. It's only 1pm so I got to get back to reality, back to emails, back to editing, all that sort of stuff. But yeah, I just wanted to mention that in case you guys haven't heard of any of those girls because oh, I'll leave all of their channels linked down below as well. But honestly, I'd be surprised if you didn't know who they were because I feel like you'd know them before you know me. But anyway, I'm going to stop talking now and I'll talk to you guys later. I think I thought I was going to continue this vlog, but I guess not. That was all the footage I got. But I hope you guys enjoyed this little hen's trip. And I will see you guys very soon for another new vlog. Goodbye.